X-Men 97 episode 4. Was it a good watch? Honestly, not. Very boring, very slow, very choppy, very undeveloped. Um, major problems with this episode. Not only is it a fluff episode, which have nothing to do with the previous episodes, which I can accept that because back in the 90s, there was fluff episodes, but they were more entertaining. This bullshit episode four, which is garbage. Um, Sunspot, Jubilee, it was really about their relationship or they developing relationship. And it's, it just, it just sucks, you know, then 15 minutes later, it goes to Storm's development story and that sucks as well. She's already in Forge's house. Forge is already telling Storm that he loves her and he's acting like a simp and it's no development. There's no backstory, especially with Storm. And I think this is a missed opportunity because I thought we were going to see Storm in the public, you know, being human, learning to accept human life or adapt to human life. We get none of that. The first time we see Storm lose her powers, what does she do? She goes on the bus. Third episode, she's in a, a diner meeting Forge. This episode, she's in Forge's house. It, there's just there's just no development, you know. I want to see how Storm adapt to human life, how she accept human life. There's none of that. This is just hey, let's do this, let's do this, and it's turning the audience off. I know some of this stuff happened in the comics, but in the comics they had a backstory to this stuff. Like I said, I still believe the first two episodes did start off start off strong, but. It just looks like it's just going downhill from here. This episode, it just didn't have any development. There's no development in Storm losing her powers and adapting to human life. And Forge just saying he loves her. Like, this is the second time we see Forge and he's already saying that he loves Storm, confessing his feelings, making men look like they're weak making men look creepy because that's what it really looks like. So it's a Disney product and it is what it is. I still think this is just a cash grab to get more subscribers because Disney is losing money. You know, there's no, you can tell they're not taking their time with this series. It's just something for you to stay hooked on a service so they can continue draining the money out your dumb asses. But that's just my, including myself, because I'm subscribed to them. But I am going to be unsubscribed to them soon. So, what do you guys think? Like, share, comment, and subscribe. Peace. Is it me? Because I know what I've seen on the screen. A half-ass product.